Hello to my Aquarius. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> yeah, so I'm doing the moon readings, um, moon love reading for all signs. Um, so if you have an Aquarius moon, this would be for you, okay? <laughs> so and this is for January 15th to the 31st. So you have the King of Swords here. You have the Six of Pentacles. You have the Queen of Wands here. You have the Five of Cups. You have the Magician here. And then here you have the Young Male here. You have the Beauty Queen. You have New Love. You have Obstacles. Excuse my card. Even though it right there. You have the Control card. You have the Gossip. You have the Young Female. So... This is you guys, okay? Um, you probably have um, your sun sign also air or probably pentacles, Virgo Capricorn Taurus. Now, <clears throat> this is you guys in your element, feeling good about yourself. I'm standing up for um, what you believe in, you know, you believe in the truth. <clears throat> this is you in your wisdom, um, with your wisdom. Um, to me, when I see um, King or Queen of Swords, I think about um, a wise older person. I think about someone that's been through a lot in their life and experiences in their life and have learned a lot. Um, so they don't have time for any shenanigans. They don't have time for BS. They don't have time for shenanigans. What you see is what you get. You better step forward to the truth or... Leave me the hell alone. That's how this is coming out to me. And I feel like <clears throat> you want to find someone, you want to be with someone you could um, share your wealth with, or you want to have someone that you could have an equal exchange with um, to, to keep the skill balance, to keep the balance going. So some of you might be married to a fire sign, or you might have this as your sun sign. Um, queen of wands, some of you might be married or in a committed relationship. Um, I feel like something happened here what, and it caused you to cry. Um, for those of you that have um, a curious moon, this situation caused you to cry. This situation caused you to lose your mind. It's almost like you couldn't sleep, like, but you forgot though. Look at that one cup still standing full filled with so much beautiful things that you're not even looking at or recognizing. All you cared about is to pour out the other two cups that you could have shared with your lover and you're crying over those four cups and there's still one cup standing up. So you need to pay attention to the one standing up, okay? And don't worry about the others that have fallen. Okay, we lose people in our lives for a reason and that's okay. And then you have the magician here. Um, so some of you will be manifesting what it is that you want. Um, or some of you could be dealing with um other elements such as um earth signs, you know, water signs. You might be for those of you that are spiritual, you might be doing some um spiritual work where you have like air, fire, earth, and water around you when you're doing this and this could be you in your element you know um in your divine um energy and you just manifesting what it is that you want um also here i do see you guys um taking a drive around and you're feeling good about yourself you're feeling on top of the world maybe you talk to a lot of people um when it comes to your job maybe um, you're a rapper, singer, or actor, actress, um, journalist, a public relations, um, newscaster, someone that you're someone that, you know, uh, perform on the stage. Maybe you're a poet, um, um, maybe you're a comedian, you know, whatever it is that puts you on that spotlight. I feel like that's your thing. That's what you do. Okay. Some of you probably write too. Um, and I feel like there's, um, a new love brewing here, but I feel like there's an obstacle in the way of that. I feel like there's an obstacle blocking you from getting to this new love. Um, also, I feel like, um, I need to move them up because I don't like putting them all the way down. I feel like some of you guys might be dealing with a younger female, 
Um, maybe this person is younger than you um, because this is a young male. So this person might be in the same um, age age gap as you. Um, and I feel like you might be dealing with a younger female. This could be a sister. This, I don't think it's your sister because this is a love reading. So I would say that this is a younger female that you're dealing with that is immature could be this person is very very um artistic they good um they're good with creativity um they probably write like i said earlier probably write poems sing dance act um write music write po poems and stuff like that they could do anything that has to do with creativity or just being in the spotlight and i feel like there's gossip around you about this person. Maybe you just met someone new um, that was like this characteristic. This person might be even 25 or um, in their 20s. And I feel like there's gossip about this person. Uh, maybe your friends are gossiping about this person. Maybe you're chit-chatting about this person to your friends. Or uh, maybe you're talking to your friends about the gig that's coming up. I feel like some of you guys need to let go of control as well. Or maybe this is your partner trying to be in control. Um, one thing I know about earth signs. Earth signs, they don't like to be in control. Yeah, they do. Um, <laughs> so this is telling you to let go of control. Um, for my spiritual people, this means that someone um, could be doing some spiritual um, work. And they're using um, baby doll to like control your every move. I was trying to keep it light, but, you know, whenever I see certain things, I have to say. Or maybe this could be the blockage in your relationship. Maybe because of this control, um, you have issues in your relationship. I'm going to get clarification, okay? All right. Okay, Aquarius. So, I did a clarification on the Five of Cups, and you got the Ten of Swords and Three of Wands. So, I feel like there's someone that lives a distance that you really wanted to connect with. I feel like there was something that happened here, either... There was more than one person involved in this situation. You might have been dealing with a um, fire sign, um, Leo Sagittarius Aries. And one of the people you were dealing with was a fire sign and one of the other was a water sign. I feel like whoever this water sign person is, um, is going through some things right now. I feel like there was something that ended. I feel like they were dealing with more than one person. And, um, one of the, one of the relation, I guess the person they're dealing with, um, that relationship ended. Okay. And they're crying about that. And I think that's what's going on. And maybe that's who you're trying to connect with and you're not able, they're unreachable. And maybe this is why they're unreachable because they're going through some type of ending here. Okay. Um, and. I did a clarification for the magician and you received the king of wands here. So I feel like this is someone that's in and out of your life. Uh, maybe this person was wearing a false mask and making you think that they were this person and they really wasn't. <coughs> Excuse me. And then you also um, received the um, high priestess and also the chariot card. So this is telling them that. Yep, some of you are dealing with a water sign, and this person is very, very intuitive. And actually, this person will be coming to see you or you to them. 